Yo guys, Blue Knots here and welcome back to another video. Now today, I am actually going to head to the port station today and I am actually going to go to the brand new Warm Spring Bart station that is down at Fremont. Now this station just opened on Saturday and I thought, you know what, let's go check it out, shall we? And see what exactly how it looks. Well, actually, I do know how it looks because I did see a couple of pictures of it. And it looks pretty cool. So, I thought, you know what, today I'm going to go down there, check it out by myself. And yeah, that's what I'm going to do. So, it's actually quite a distance to get to that new Warm Spring BART station. And I'll show you in a minute why it's actually such a long trip. So, this is where we are. We basically have to go all the way around this place. about an hour and a half to get entirely, but it's worth the journey to check out this brand new station. on the Daily City and Fremont line. But today, it's gonna to be a little bit different. Because today, we are gonna be riding the new extension to Warm Spring. And here it is. let's go upstairs so we're actually gonna be starting from the outside of the station and the first thing I see here so there's this big little round thing which is pretty nice it's a pretty small station believe it or not I mean I thought it would be bigger than this when I look at, at the picture of it but it's actually really small uh, I'm not sure you guys can see it but there's a little bit kind of like um, some painting or some sort of things I think that's what this is. There's this big parking garage. We've got a couple of news van here. Not sure if they're forecasting here just to show you that this is the first day. This is actually the first day of the weekday schedule that this station is open. It's a very scenic view in the background over there. Look at all the mountains. And yeah, it doesn't seem like there's a lot of things. I think is that a road or a highway? I think that's a road. The thing over there where the cars are very fastly moving, that's um, Interstate 880, if I'm not mistaken. So we're back at the top of the station. Of course, you got this little footbridge to the station corridor. You also got two elevators over here, or the lift, if you're British. But yeah, you got two lift here. And of course, that is the station entrance. Um, and of course you got over there, down there, there's the platform. And I believe over here, you see where the train track is? Um, also is that, is that an SD60 that I see there? Not quite sure, but I think that line where the train track runs, not the one on the left, but the one on the far right, I think that's where the Capitol Porter also runs. So now of course I'm back on top of the station. This is of course the bike track. And this was the track I was talking about earlier. Now that I see a little bit better, that looked like an SD60, or it might be an ES44AC, but it's a pretty nice view. 
So now we are on platform level, and as you can see, it is really quiet. And I think the reason why it's really quiet, oh wait, actually, there's one person over there. But the reason why this is really quiet is because this is a brand new station. And of course, not a lot of people actually go here, since I don't see like a lot of housing area here. But So now, of course, I am back on the train right now. Um, my final thoughts on this new Warm Spring bus station is that it looks really normal. Like it looks like any other board station. Of course, I I kind of like the design and of course the outside with that little cylinder thing, uh, or at least that's what I I call it pretty much. Um, that of course is pretty nice. But other than that, it looks really normal. I mean, there's obviously a bike rack upstairs. There's obviously ticket counter. There's like a like a help desk over there, and, and of course elevator to get get up to the platform well not up to the platform but up to like where you buy the tickets but overall it's nothing really that special um other than just kind of like a normal station i would thought that there would probably is something like special that is different from other bar station but in the end of the day there wasn't really anything different it was pretty much the same thing but yeah, that's pretty much my visit of the brand new Warm Spring Park Station done and dusted. I know this is kind of relatively a very short video because I thought there would be more to explore around the station, but it turns out there was really not much to see other than just a kind of a brand new station. So as usual guys, if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you guys leave a like and subscribe to my YouTube channel. I would really appreciate it. And yeah, I will see you guys next time.